Hey guys, this is Al from TechAndCompany.com. Today I'm doing a review of InfoLinks. This site is an awesome revenue generating site that allows you to put in text ads on your site. Now, if you are looking for an alternative to Google AdSense, um, this is a monetization alternative. However, you're going to notice that there is a significant difference in the amount of income that you are generating from Google AdSense versus InfoLinks. And it's just because the platforms are totally different and InfoLinks has a different um, business model as far as um, the way that they distribute ads in their network. All right. But this is an awesome site. I've been using InfoLinks for years on my sites and I have found that um, they consistently perform well. All right, so let's get started. All right, so if you're a publisher and you're looking to get uh, your site monetized, InfoLinks has about four um, ways in which you can monetize your site using their service. And then they have the ability within their dashboard that you can turn on and turn off certain functionalities. So it's not like if you uh, um, sign up for InfoLinks, you're locked in to whatever it is that they offer as far as the four platforms. You can turn um, the ones you like on and turn the ones that you don't like off. All right, so let's talk about the main one that's like the most popular, and this is the in-text ads. Basically, an in-text ad is where you would have text, and then as someone would uh, scroll over that with their cursor, cursor um, what happens is an ad would pop up giving them some information related to that keyword there, which is basketball. And this is an example of something related to basketball. Now, if a um, person clicks on that ad um, and gets taken to the website because that interests them, you earned um, some income because of them doing that. Now, um, also, InfoLinks has an Infold ad. Now, I tell you the, the truth, I do not like infold ads. I kind of find them to be a little bit annoying, but I'll explain why. Because typically when you're um, um, using these info ads on your site or someone's using them, um, they come up from the bottom and they obscure the view of the text. And they just come in, they, yeah, they, they are attention grabbers, but I can't stand the way that they just come up. So I don't activate the info ads on my sites, even though they say, you know, you want to get maximum revenue and so on, I just can't stand them. So I don't activate it. If you love them, let me know in the comments. If you think that that's the greatest thing in the world, that's fine. But I personally don't um, use these info ads. Now, the in tag ads, I find these to be amazing. And here's why. Because basically, uh, they're creating not only content for you as far as the keywords, because you don't have to use your, you don't have to put in your own keywords like the in-text ads or have ads that your users provide like the in-text ads. These are in-tag ads. So basically what happens is they create keywords that relate to something they locked on to um, on your website. So related key words for that page and then those are put in and then of course it still follows the same format of when you go over those with your little pointer or a cursor then an ad will come up someone clicks on that and of course you earn income and the last format that I'm going to talk about is uh, this one and that's the in frame ads now I really uh, don't use in frame ads. Um, I, it, I I feel about them the same way I feel about the info ads. I really can't stand them because I don't like things coming in from the side. And besides, I feel like the size of my websites can be monetized differently. You may have a different opinion, but that's what it is. Now let's talk about the money. All right, now um, with info links your typical payment threshold is fifty dollars okay so you have to get fifty dollars or more before they will pay you um, it's 45 days 
And what happens here is that it's a net 40 pay cycle. And so as long as you get um, that money within that 45 you days, then they send you your payment using PayPal. Now, here is the thing about InfoLinks that you need to keep in mind. Um, it is a Google AdSense alternative. However, you are not going to make the same money you make with Google AdSense. So if you go into this thinking that I'm, I'm going to put this on my site and I'm going to make millions of dollars or thousands of dollars a month, uh, you're in for a rude awakening um, unless you have um, lots and lots and lots of traffic. And I'm talking about maybe 50,000 um, visitors a day or higher or, you know, so if unless that's happening for you, um, you're not going to see Google AdSense type revenue um, with InfoLinks because the the advertisers that use InfoLinks as an ad network, um, they're not paying that because this is not the same and it doesn't have the same reach as uh, Google AdSense. So you just want to keep that in mind. The payment threshold is significantly um, dwarf in comparison to um, Google um, AdSense because you're not just going to get paid as much because the advertisers are different and Google just has a larger reach. All right, so with that in mind, it's a great way to monetize. And then, of course, you can also try the demo. They let you change the color of your ads. I just wanted to mention that as well. You can change the color of your ads um, that um, the links that appear and this is how it works folks it's just it'll look something like this you put the code in on your site this is what that um, that ad looks like when it's coming up and down you can see why I kind of don't like it that much but people love it as far as the revenue base but I'm just not a fan all right and then let's see what's happening here um, with the in fold, uh, in frame, I'm sorry, you'll see how it comes in on the side. I don't know if you like that, but that's what happens. And then, of course, um, we saw the in tag earlier. All right. Um, with this is the in tag. And this right here is the in text. So that's what the in text will look like. Now, you can, of course, change all the colors. They have different color combinations. What I have found, I'm going to tell you some of my secret sauce here. I have found that orange works the best. Um, it's something about the color orange that people just click on it and they don't feel as intimidated. Um, I know in, in the U.S., anytime that we see something in red, um, we look at that more intensely because we're con being conditioned to that because of our stop signs being red our s and our stop lights being red meaning stop and we're conditioned to do that but that also gives people the feeling like they should not click on it so but orange is that color that makes people do it green is kind of like begging for attention here and so these are my opinions folks um, and then um, we don't want to really do that Okay, blue kind of like blends in to everything. You probably won't get as many clicks with blue, but I found when I switched the color to orange, my revenues went up significantly. All right, guys, that is my review of InfoLinks. Please give it a try. Uh, you can click the link below this video to be taken to InfoLinks, and let's get started making some money. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great one.